Welcome back. It is 837. There were some tears at the Grammys and some were turned away with all the drama. Harvey Levin's in L.A. with more. So what's up with Paul McCartney? What's going on? Oh, uh, Lauren, I cannot wait to tell you about this. Okay, this is what? the best video we have gotten of the year in the year so far. This oh, is wow. unreal. Paul McCartney, Beck, and Taylor Hawkins from the Foo Fighters go to Argyle, which is a hot nightclub in Hollywood, okay. uh, after the Grammys, and they are going to Tyga's after party. I'm not sure why Tyga's after party, but they did. They go to the door. They are denied. What? They are denied. It's Paul McCartney. And, <laughs> and, um, and, and it's Paul McCartney. And, and basically, he looks at these guys and he says, how much bigger do we have to be? I and mean, just as a joke, do we need another hit? And they turn him away. They go back to the door. And they turn him away again. And they are talking to these guys. And I'm sure at a point, he must, I mean, I don't know if he said, I'm Paul McCartney. But it was amazing. They left. They did not get in this club. Paul McCartney, the biggest Living person in music by far is turned away at a Grammy after party. It is amazing. We are obviously, my goal today is to find that bouncer and get him on TMC Live. Oh, yeah, that'd be good. Yeah, <laughs> gosh, if Paul McCartney can't get in, who can get in? I want to know who is at that party now. <laughs> Un Let's unbelievable. Let's talk about Taylor Swift becomes the first woman to win album of the year twice at the Grammy. So why was she crying? What, what, what was happening? Well, apparently she didn't. A couple, she she was not in a good mood all night long. Uh, she uh -oh. um, apparently missed a note or felt she missed a note, and you see her when she sits down. She kind of wipes a tear, and Selena Gomez is comforting her, and she says, "I missed a note. I missed that note," oh. and uh, it upset her. You know, nobody else heard it, but she heard it. Yeah. And then when she won uh, Album of the Year, she trashed Kanye West. Oh. I mean, she never used his name, but it's very uh -huh. clear. She's talking about Kanye because Kanye, in his last, in the track that he released last week, said he made her famous with a couple of choice words added, and uh, she says that it's misogynistic. She is furious, and she made that clear. You know, making uh, making her speech saying to all women, nobody else makes you famous but you, and it was very clear it was a shot at Kanye. Yeah, yeah, it was it was an interesting speech. Uh, let's talk about Lamar Odom. Apparently, he's getting some help decorating his. New home. They're, they're, he's moving into a home in Calabasas that's near Khloe Kardashian, and it seems like the Kardashians are are taking things over, taking his life over. <laughs> well, they are taking his life over. That's a good way of putting it. Um, you know, Khloe rented the house a block from hers, <coughs> and uh, he has two interior decorators now, and one of them is his mother-in-law, Chris Jenner, mm -hmm. uh, Chris and Faye Resnick, uh, who is now an interior designer. She became famous, actually, interestingly. In interestingly enough, um, in the O.J. Simpson case, she was Nicole Brown Simpson's best friend. So the two of them went to a big furniture warehouse over the weekend, I think on Valentine's Day, and they had a $65,000 budget, Whoa. we're told, and they went to buy to furnish Lamar's house. Hmm. Uh, and they bought a bunch of stuff. They spent four and a half hours shopping, and uh, those are his interior decorators. Wow. Now, do you think the Kardashians are going to bail out Kanye West, too? Do you really think he's $50 million in debt? Even he says now he's not. I mean, oh. it's all baloney. <laughs> and what he's, now, what he's saying is that he invested $53 million, and now he's realized he needs to use other people's money to make even more money. So it was all a big sham. Thank you so much, Harvey. <laughs> we love the drama. Okay, Lauren. You can see TMZ weeknights at 11 p.m., weekdays at 3 p.m. here on Fox 4. You can also find a link to the show's website at fox4news.com. It is 841 right now.